Hello, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's recipe. So we had to change things up a little bit. Uh, so my crock pot's in a new new place. Um, but today we are going to make a crock pot meal, obviously. And it is going to be buffalo chicken um, with veggies. So if you'd like to see how to create this, basically a breakdown of how much all this stuff was, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. It's about budget food, but also healthier food options. So make sure you subscribe. All that jazz. Okay, so um, I got this chicken, obviously, as you saw, for $3.29. And it is 14 ounces, so almost a pound. Um, I'm going to be using a whole onion. And then I got this beautiful bag of bell peppers for 99 cents. So I'm going to be using a little bit of all of them. So that way we have a nice array of color. And then I'm going to be, like, when it's done in the crock pot, I'm going to be putting it on top of a bed of this Nor rice side Spanish rice. So we're a little over $5, but the thing is, is that we're not going to be using all the bell peppers. So that cuts down, and most likely we will have leftovers. But let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to go ahead and wash my bell peppers, and we'll go ahead and get started. Okay, I'm gonna be doing pretty large strips of my bell pepper. Um, and I'm only gonna be using like maybe a third, maybe a quarter of each pepper, just because there is four large peppers. So let me go in and just start getting chomping. And I'm gonna be putting leftover peppers in a gallon bag so that way I can um, get ready to, that way I can dehydrate these, but let's go ahead and start chopping. Okay, so done with the peppers and onions. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just start grabbing handfuls and just putting them in here. Doing kind of a nice mix of onion and bell pepper. Okay, so this is what we're looking like. So pretty full of peppers and onions. We're gonna be putting the chicken right on top. So let's go ahead and do that. So a lot of times I do like putting my meat on top of my vegetables. Just gives it a nice, nice kind of look. And plus it helps flavor the, uh, helps to flavor it. So this is already seasoned, as you can tell. It's already seasoned with buffalo. If you just have plain chicken, you could totally just uh, use buffalo seasoning, um, dressing, marinade, whatever. Buffalo sauce, if you will. And uh, do the same thing. This is shaved, but you can also do this with just regular chicken breast or chicken thighs. Okay using my other hand to grab the tripod. 
but this is what we're looking like. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on low, and I'm going to let it do its thing, and uh, we'll be we'll be touching base when it's done and uh, the rice is made. Okay, so I'm just getting ready to make the Nor Spanish rice, just following the directions on the back of the package, except I'm not adding vegetable oil to it, just to make it a little bit healthier. So, yeah. So, Spanish rice turned out looking good. So I'm just going to do a little bit of Spanish rice. And then here is our chicken, bell pepper, and onion. A lot of liquid got released from the bell peppers and onions. I'm just going to put it right on top. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and taste this. Um, let's do this. Definitely need some salt and pepper. But really, really good. I would totally buy that buffalo chicken again. Turned out good, and I like it on top of the rice. So really quick, easy meal to prep. Um, just put it in the crock pot and let it go. And turned out beautiful. Absolutely love this. But anyway, there we go. Um, I hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments um, if you've ever picked up that buffalo chicken from your local grocery store. What is your favorite chicken recipe in the crock pot? Let me know down below. And of course, you're welcome to follow me on my social media. I have Facebook and Instagram, and it is at Budget Glam Babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start autoplaying here very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that will be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.